Hi guys, I wanted to jump on here really quickly to talk about this Katie Rolston, uh, Sharice Jordan situation. Okay, so uh, about a day ago, 17 hours or somewhat, uh, Katie posted on her social media. She was actually commenting on this picture that the women had posted on their social media. And she starts out by saying, Mia, you look so pretty, killing it. Then she says, however, after I took that pic of Mia, I thought, oh, my God, I'm so glad I didn't get cheesy fake boobs like Ashley. But it will serve her well trying to snag the next millionaire. Pretty sure it's not going to go as planned. Only fans, options. Then she says, maybe next season on RHOP, they will ask Sharice about the night we had sex and I lied for her so she could get her settlement. Maybe I'm not bitter, just saying. Or maybe she is so entertaining, we will all be amazed as dot, 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 never. So there you have it. She came straight out and said that she had sex with Sharice. Now, of course, as expected, this blew up the Internet. I mean, it went everywhere. It's a really a salacious statement. Like, what the hell is going on? But if you really break it down, there's a lot of different ways you can take this statement. So I intentionally waited for the next day just to see if Sharice would respond. And she hasn't responded as of yet. I mean, I keep checking. I see nothing. And if you don't respond, people have no choice but to come to their own conclusions. And that's exactly what they're doing. Now, some people are saying that Katie admitted to having a drug problem, has gotten out of rehab, works at some store. I think it's like the Dollar General where she only makes $14 an hour. And people really, really ridiculed her as if, you know, they look down on her for making an honest living. But, you know... As long as you're healthy and you're climbing your way back, I really don't get why people were making fun of her. As a matter of fact, she's more level-headed than ever before. She's really just coming through as a person that's gotten her life together and really cleaned up the, her act. And this is causing some people to say that Katie's more level-headed than ever. She knows exactly what she's talking about. Who would make up a lie like this for no reason? And then there are people who are saying... Katie suffers from mental health issues, and she just relapsed, and this is what she's doing, and she's talking out the side of her head. Other people are saying this is all just for show. Katie came out a couple weeks ago and publicly asked Andy Cohen to hire her back, and then she admitted that he did not respond. So some people are saying, what a good way to get Andy's attention, especially since no one on the cast are sure if they're coming back or not. By Robin just uh, hiding the fact that Juan was having an affair, the cast, for the very first time in a long time, has no idea where the storylines are going to go on the upcoming season. It's obvious that Andy Cohen is upset with Robin, and so therefore her and Juan might be out. Then uh, Mia, with all of her lies, the public is very upset with Mia. She could be out. They absolutely have no idea who's coming back. There's Ashley with absolutely no storyline. There's absolutely no way to know who's going and who's staying. According to the rumors, some women are very, very worried about losing their jobs. And this is why on the off season, all of this craziness is happening. It's like they're throwing something out there just to see what sticks. You got Mia fighting publicly with Peter. You have Michael Darby trying to take Candace to court. You have... Giselle coming forward with her new boyfriend. I can't remember his name, but he's from Summer House. You have a photo uh, circulating around the internet of Juan's alleged mistress. It's like the storylines are just as intense off season as it was during the season. So it's really hard to try to figure out where Katie Rose is coming from by posting something like this, saying that she actually slept with Cherise. So it's, a, it's like, is she saying this just to get back on the show? Or is she saying this because it's really, really true? And she's tired of Sharice throwing out everyone else's dirt and not her own. And before I end this video, I wanted to acknowledge that I have been mispronouncing uh, Katie's last name. It is Ross, not Roast. I don't know why it keeps coming out Roast. I know the difference, but um, I guess I'm just tired. So Katie, if you're listening to this, uh, please forgive me. So let me know your thoughts in the comments section. 
is Katie just making a big scene and lying so she can get back on the show? Or does she know exactly what she's talking about? And she's tired of Sharice telling everybody else's business but her own. I mean, I, it, it's crazy, people. It's crazy. Also, if you haven't already liked this video, don't forget to do that. If you haven't already subscribed and hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video, don't forget to do that. I'll meet you guys down in the comment section. We have a lot to talk about. Until next time, bye for now.